So while I was making a heap of buildings, I had a great idea for a tool. So I made it. Making strips of balsa wood with a ruler and knife can get a little tedious and take a whole lot of time. But with a couple of bits of foam board and a spare knife blade, you can ditch the ruler and make perfect cuts every time. Here's how to do it. Get a piece of scrap cardboard or foam board, whatever, it's not really important. Place it on the side of the material you want to strip. Then take another material, the width you want to cut, and place it on top. Then you glue these pieces together in place. Then super glue a knife blade on an angle, making sure it's touching the cutting surface below. And then you can cut to your heart's content or your knife blade goes dull. If you want to adjust the widths of your cuts, just use a different width material as your centerpiece. After making a few of these, I showed my dad with the intention of maybe 3D printing one or making an adjustable one. But after a bit of research, it turns out this is already a thing. It's called a balsa wood stripper. And it's really popular in like the scale aeroplane community where they use a lot of balsa wood because it's light and pretty structural. Even though it's already a thing, we decided to make a new one anyway. The middle bit's adjustable to any material height and you can cut different widths by replacing the center plate. And the feature I love the most, it takes utility blades, the workhorse of blades. So it's really cool. Thanks, Dad. Also, you can use a balsa wood stripper on EVA foam, like the kids craft stuff that's in obnoxious colors and smells a bit weird. And it makes for a good balsa wood alternative for making buildings like I did here. I really wish I knew about this tool a whole lot earlier. So hopefully this will help someone else too. All right, that's it. I'll see you soon.